Hello everybody, Lance here. And uh, some of you probably recognize this mask before. Okay, this is the mask of uh, Tiffany, a character that I am working on. And uh, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you the a quick and easy way to make this kind of ornament. Okay, so let's get started. Alright, so this is the mask and it has a UV like this. And uh, this is actually just a simple thin piece of plastic that uh, I use some modifiers to add the thickness and uh, uh, the 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 edge okay so this mask currently has two material the default plastic at the center and the gold around the edge like so and uh, I'm sure you already know how to how to do all this so I'm not gonna get into that so let's change this to the shader editor there we go and we will not touch the gold material because it ju it's just a simple principal material okay so let's go ahead and switch to the mask and uh, this principal material we will use this as uh, the plastic all right and this one will be gold but uh, instead of uh, making a new gold let's just copy this material and copy there we go and uh, mix these together all right now create a new texture image texture and uh, connect this to the factor now we will create a bump node and connect this color into the height and connect the the bump to the the material or maybe just create a displacement and uh, connect this to the height and connect the displacement to the displacement output. Alright, and uh, let's set the scale to something smaller like 0 0.05. We will create a math node or maybe a color ramp node and decrease the white key all the way to the left, something close to the left, like so. Alright, now let's start painting our texture. Switch to material preview and uh, let's start painting our material. Now control tab and go to textured painting mode and select the mask material and uh, select the ornament uh, texture. Okay. Alright, now select the draw brush. Okay, the hotkey, I mean the shortcut is number one. And in here we will tweak this, uh, this brush a little. Under the color picker, choose gradient. There we go. And in the gradient mapping, choose pressure, like so. And get rid of the pressure sensitivity for the strength. Now set the black, key, the left key to black and the right key to white. And now let's make a brush stroke. There we go. So let's go to solid and let's see. So you see the pressure sensitivity now control the color of the brush. The next thing you want to do is to turn on size pressure so that the pressure sensitivity also control the size. Okay. And finally change the blend mode to lighten. Okay. Blender will choose the brighter color which is the white color that already that is already painted, okay? But if you press a bit more stronger you will be able to paint across the darker color okay there we go so if you use the blend mode mix like this and you have an ornament like this and now I make a light brush stroke it will actually cut through the the higher part like so and I don't want that so let's switch this to lighten all right now the small lines like this will not cut through uh, the the higher brush stroke okay so if you want to have a higher brush stroke you have to press more heavily okay all right now let's start painting go down to the symmetry and turn on x symmetry and let's just paint something 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 like that Okay, it's very quick and easy. There we go. You can get 
all crazy and it, it will be super super quick okay now you may have noticed that my brush stroke is not very stable and uh, this is partially because of uh, the way blender handle the brush stroke so uh, it it's not going to be stable regardless of how you make the brush stroke okay so you need to turn on the stabilizer okay go to the uh, stroke menu and go down here we have stabilize stroke turn that on and now you can tweak these settings to uh, smooth your brush stroke and I find this to be too smooth so maybe there we go it's a bit better but uh, maybe less smooth maybe something like that okay just get crazy with it Paint, maybe paint some leaf so with the uh, smooth brush you cannot paint some very small details so we will get back to paint the small details later okay there we go very quickly we have some very nice ornament for our playing so let's turn off the stabilizer and uh, maybe make some dots there we go maybe add some more leaves and uh, let's zoom in a little to stabilize our stroke there we go there we go and uh, maybe some more some more shapes like so mm. let's turn back on the stabilizer and nah. and uh, maybe decrease this to 3 and There we go something like that so you can see very quickly we now have some very nice ornament for the mask and uh, maybe some circle there we go get all crazy with your imagination alright that's it with the tutorial I hope you find this technique useful for your project I'll see you next time